With AI tools, you can go from creating a basic 3D model to creating AI images and moving video within minutes. Here's how. Adobe has launched Project Neo into beta. It's a 3D modeling tool that you can use directly in your browser. When you go to the page, you can see all these incredible creations that people have already created using the tool, and you can also start to design your own. When you open up the page, you're gonna have a plateau with a cube on it. You can adjust the angle by zooming in and out using your mouse scroll wheel. You can also use the toggles on the left and the top of the field view display to change the angle of the camera as well. The box that you see with the white thing around the white box, that is your camera. That is what will be exported when you do wanna download what you have created. You can download like a JPEG or like a PNG of that image. We'll get to that. When you click on the object, in this case, the cube, you can move it up and around anywhere on the on the xyz axis you can use the arrows to drag it up and down to drag it side to side there's also another shape next to the arrows which you can click and drag to expand the size of the shape the width of the shape the bulk of the shape all these things you have full flexibility to do this in 3d space but complete beginner and i wanted to make a candle and the best way to do that is to grab the cylinder uh, shape tool that is already available for you plop down the first cylinder you can already start to adjust the color of it and then you can add another cylinder straight on top of it. You'll see that it will try and give you as many options as possible to see that you're placing it directly. There'll be some orange kind of things that appear to, so you can see that it's being placed on top of the other one. And you can start to stack these up uh, to create a candle. I went with like a four stage stack of cylinders. I did, the, I changed the colors between them in and out. Um, and just that gives me the base of what I need for my candle. What's really cool is that they also have like a teardrop or a drop shape already in the tool as well, which you can grab, which kind of looks like a flame. And I have attached that to the top of the candle, change the color of that, and there you go. I have a candle, really basic. I'm still learning here, but it's a really cool way to start learning about the tool. Um, and since I'm new to 3D modeling, was able to make a candle. It's great, I love it. From there, the next stage which I, which I recommend doing is going to download. I recommend making the background transparent and you're just downloading a PNG or a JPEG of your created candle. You can then move that downloaded image straight into Adobe Firefly and use the structure reference feature here to completely reimagine your 3D creation within seconds. I found this really cool prompt from the database of Adobe Firefly created by the community and I've just attached my new image, made it so it's a 16 by 9 image and you can see immediately that we have a really cool creation based off the 3D model that you've just created. I really recommend playing around with different prompts here to get different viewpoints and different imaginations and different art work just try it out firefly is awesome and the structure reference works really well with project neo once you have the created image though you can even do even more with it and this is why i recommend uh dragging it across into a tool like pika labs where you can animate that video or that image into a video a simple drag and drop exercise drop the image in adjust the camera settings so if, in my case i wanted to be zooming out and just let pika labs do the rest of it and as a result, you're left with this incredible moving AI image that you created using your 3D modeling skills on uh, Adobe Project Neo. Really recommend checking out this tool. It's honestly so much fun to play with. And every day I just keep jumping in and making more and more stuff. And I think it's just such a user-friendly way to start jumping into 3D modeling and to immediately use the AI tools that Adobe are creating to completely reimagine it as you go on the spot. Thank you for watching and I really recommend checking out Project Neo. I'll leave all the links somewhere, whether it's in the video or in the description or in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching.